What's going on everybody? Hopefully you guys are having a great day so far. Today is June 4th, 2020. That's when we are recording this video. Uh, right now we are going to be doing an unboxing video. Um, I've already tried the products out from this website, so I'm not going to be doing a product review. They are real good. Uh, he will be doing a short little review. Um... So, in this video, again, not a paid sponsor, we are unboxing beard products. Of course, as you can see from my beard, I like, I, I love my beard. You know, it's, I was uh, talking to uh, my mom's last night, and I was sitting there saying that this is actually like a pride, in, my pride and joy. I take very good pride in my beard. Um, it did kill me for a while because I couldn't uh, get the right beard products for it um i had to go like to walmart and target and Ooh, the smell so far is weird. yeah just like, oh, make sure you didn't cut your damn self i made sure was, um other than that you know going to target walmart it did kind of dry out my beard because a lot of those products aren't formulated properly Gotta be real careful, dude. No, I didn't kill myself. I was looking at it. So, a, a paper cut through the box. Here it is. Hey, give me, where's that sticker? Give me the sticker. What the hell? There's two. And a. <laughs> yeah, it's a pig. Free bottle on your next order over fifty dollars. I will leave down in the description where to go get okay, where to go get the product. Use code growth to get yourself a free bottle of uh, what is this? This is the vitamin. Yeah, this is the beard vitamins. Um, before you guys do that. Please do your research on a lot of the uh, beard vitamins and stuff like that. To be honest with you guys, um, I don't take those. To be real, I think it's just a waste of money. Why is it so out of focus? There we go. Um, I don't. I don't take those. Um, to be honest, I think if you get a good thick beard, it is all about genes. But. You never know. I've never tried those. Um, if you have, let me know down in the comments or something. If you have, um, here's one of their stickers. Uh, I do kind of collect stickers from where I bought stuff from. I don't think I have this one. And then this is their special June, month of June sticker. Only you can grow a badass beer. Um, I guess this company's been there since 2014. That's what that says. EST 2014. Uh, that is Mr. Smokey the Badass Bear. Okay, so the scents that I bought are seasonal scents. Huh? They're more parts instead of like features. Alright, yeah, I'll, I'll make sure to put those in. Put those in towards the end. And then this is the color tells you how to do how to follow the rules. Oh, I don't need that. I've, I've done enough. But it's still, I'll let them. Anyways, the seasonal scent that I bought, because trust me, I'm going to have to let these steep for a while, so I'm going to crack them both open. Ooh, I love that smell. Um, so the seasonal scent I go for whenever they have it um, that looked like it was uh, I don't know but I go with the brewmaster this is a very good scent we squirted that was shook up. I barely It's the pressure. It's yeah, the pressure. So it's looking deep. I'm holding it. 
Got a little on my nose. You smell that? That that's the scent I uh, that I've gotten. That's the scent I love. It's like a uh, it's almost like a citrusy type. It makes a citrusy with uh, mm -hmm. that one. I feel like the plant's called. This is one of my favorite scents from them. Um, my other favorite scent. What was it? It was either the Viking or the Mountain Man. It was one of those two. Um, it smells like, because I, I can smell the lavender in it, but I, I thought there was another one. This is, yeah, this is probably the only thing oh, I like that's lavender. The eucalyptus. That's what it was. Because I can smell the eucalyptus and the lavender mixed with uh, some sort of citrus smell. So that's what I was wondering. I, I don't understand how there's apricot oil in there. I don't. You can't smell the apricot. I might know, but I'm saying like in general. Because, okay, inside here, there's apricot kernel oil, um, argan oil, jujuba oil, vitamin E oil, Siberian fir oil. Grapefruit, tangerine, orange, lavender, tea tree, rosemary, eucalyptus, oil, and pure bad acery. Exactly what it says on here. It says shake well before use. Use dropper to place three to six drops of your oil per inch of your own hair uh, on your palm and rub together. I mean basic stuff apply to beard massage into your hair and skin add more as needed with a beard no. with a beard like mine I got to use like two or three uh, palms full of it just so it could soak in the right way um, the benefits for those of you who are just growing out their beard or they do have the you guys complain about itchy beards the benefits for this is it softens your beard and skin reduces beard itch and dandruff uh, tames fly away hairs promotes healthy hair growth repairs split ends adds a healthy shine and of course attracts the ladies not everybody needs to know that last part I do have two bottles of that. I made sure to get me some that will last a couple oh, months. So you only have two of the same one? Yeah, I got the same one. Oh, okay. What is this? That, my friend, is beard and body wash. Here is Chuck's Hog Wash. Now, what this is, is it's a hair, beard, and body wash. Um, I don't use it for the body. You may want to try it just once. Mm. It actually feels pretty good. Uh, it kind of moisturizes your whole skin. Yeah. But anyways, if you guys can, get yourself a thing of beard wash. It's real good to clean the pores and everything out. Um, for me personally, because I do have dry skin without that. This is good to get rid of all the oils and everything. But make sure if you guys do, do uh, wash out your beard with any kind of product. As soon as you're done, dry your beard the best you can. I'm going to put this on backwards. There we go. Much better. Anyways, dry out your beard the best you can and apply oil. The oil is going to help save your beard from getting very itchy dry out your skin all that it's kind of like when you wash your hair you don't wash your hair all the time um, if by chance you put the oil in your beard you have any extra either rub it on your arms like I got I got hairy arms or rub it in your hair just to get rid of the excess do not waste you know it, it sucks because a lot of the time not many people can get the product anyways moving on to the next thing this is the first time I bought one of these so this is what I'm probably most excited for. You got the badass donkey. Badass beard care. And it's a beard brush. 
I've never, ever, ever, since growing out my beard, I've had a beard brush. So I'm very excited to use this and see how it is. Uh, check that out. Feel that. It's not too hard, not too soft. It's like the perfect. Yeah. All right. That's all the products in here. Now what we're going to do is I've already gone over this card. I'm not part of this, so I don't have to put this up here, to be honest. I should be part of that one though, but I'm not. Okay, so on here, um, I'm going to go, why is that snow? Okay, that's where the pick was. Yeah. Uh, on here, it's the list of the scents that they have. I will go over the scents with you guys real quick. So you have the original, which is sandalwood and vanilla, the ladies man, is lemon and vanilla. The biker is patchouli, sandalwood, and peppermint. The bushwhacker is lemongrass, eucalyptus, and citronella. The outlaw is sweet tobacco, vanilla, and black pepper. That's actually the one I normally will go if the brewmaster is not there. Um, Mountain man, which is another one. Pine and cedar. So mountain man is pine and cedar. Uh, the Viking is the Siberian fir, orange, and clove. I've had that one before. It was okay. I'm not a big fan of that one. So that, it was the Outlaw and Mountain Man that I go with. Uh, you got the Patriot, which is cedarwood, tea tree, rosemary, and patchouli. I'm, hopefully I'm saying that right. Uh, the Pirate is bay leaf. Orange, lime, and clove. El Barista, which, if you guys could tell, that's coffee. Just coffee. The Royal Knight is an Earl Grey tea and lavender. And then you have Secret Agent, which is none, uh, it's unscented. It just gives you the benefits of everything. So, if you're afraid to want to try out a new flavor, or not flavor, uh, scent, I mean, it is a flavor, but it, you don't taste it. But, anyways, if you guys want, uh, go to badassbeardcare.com slash free sample. Uh, I'm not sure exactly what you guys will uh, be running into on that. Um, you may just end up paying just the shipping. Uh, don't quote me on that, please. Uh, I'm not a sponsor. I'm not a paid person with them. I'm just somebody who loves my beard. Uh, you can follow them on uh, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. All at Badass Beard Care. Put that up for you guys. Come on. Focus. Yeah, good enough. Um... On the back here, it does have instructions on how to uh, wash your beard and everything. Um, you do the wash. Of course, you apply the oil. Apply balm or wax. I personally don't use that. All that does is seal in everything. Um, and then you use your brush or your comb. Um, anyways, guys, that's it for this video. Um, he's not here right now, but I would like to thank my brother for doing this video with us. Uh, I know he doesn't have the facial hair or anything, so I do like want to thank him for that. Um, anyways, you guys, again, have a great day. Stay safe, stay hydrated. Cali's over 100 degrees right now. Let me know where you guys are tuning in from if you watch this down below. Uh, I will put a link to their website as well as the growth um, growth code for your free vitamins if you want those you guys have a great day laters